हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू बॉटनी इनसाइडर सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द पोस्ट दैट आई हैव अपलोडेड अ फ्यू डेज बैक ऑन द कम्युनिटी पोस्ट आई आज यू ऑल अबाउट द डिफिकल्टी एंड आई एम ट्राइंग टू आंसर टू यू ऑल द मोस्ट कॉमन क्वेश्चन दैट आई हैव रिसीव द नेक्स्ट कॉमन क्वेश्चन इज दैट हाउ टू स्टडी द टेक्निक्स दैट मीन्स द यूनिट नंबर थर्टीन Unit number thirteen is a very big task to complete. I can completely understand this particular point. Reason being, I also felt the difficulty of how to complete that unit. It is very vast, and you need to cover many topics. So, how to approach this unit? Very important point you have to remember is first thing, do not go for the complete unit. Do not just try to complete out the complete unit that you want to do every single bullet point. You would end up wasting at least two months or maybe more. Don't do this mistake. What you can do is first thing is read the previous year question papers, grab the important points that which are the various important random questions that are being asked, and then. sit and study now how to complete these techniques first thing you have to remember is you need not to go into the working principle you, all you have to do is you need to have the principle that means what is the actual area in which that particular technique is used what is the way in which this technique is used for example if you are studying for the pcr that is the polymerase chain reaction so the principle for that is that you have a dna and then you have to amplify that dna this is the basic principle this is just a very simple example i have given you have to read it in depth so first thing is the principle that what is the actual mechanism on which the technique is based upon and then you need to have a clear understanding of that what are the applications reason being many questions are framed from the application area the working area is not very important if you do not have that much time you can skip off that part you can do the principle portion and then the application part so for that what you can do is you can use the youtube videos just search out any of the topic for example let's say you are searching out for the pcr itself so just write down polymerase chain reaction principle and then you'll find some video or the other use those videos understand the concept and then if you want to make the notes from the same what you have to do is go to the google search and then just write down polymerase chain reactions principle you will get some article or the other if you want to study if you want to work on your own way you have to put in an extra effort and you have to search out the information you won't be getting it at one place itself you have to work for the same so let's say you were searching out for the pcr as we were discussing so now you have to find the notes for that use google search and you'll get some of the articles for the same use that article read that article and then make bullet points for the same then comes the application portion just write down polymerase chain reactions application and then jot down the applications as well in the same manner you can do it for all the other techniques as well it is very important and also it is easy if you do it in a systematic manner if you have a working principle of each of the of the technique in your mind that yes this is the technique that i am studying and this is the principle for the same and this is the area in which this particular technique is utilized you'll be able to answer any of the question and for the practice purpose go for the previous year question papers this is the best and the smartest way in which you could attempt the unit number 13 talking about the biophysical methods and all the other ones if you feel like doing it just have a important uh, bullet points from the google then we have one of the topic from the microscopy that is very important and if you want to cover microscopy i have tried to complete the complete topic in the best manner possible on my channel just use those videos and you can complete at least that particular portion from that particular playlist i'll put the links of the playlist of the topics that i have uploaded you can use that playlist i have i guess complete it 10 to 12 topics from the same you can use that and then remaining topics could be done in the manner i have just explained you so i hope this particular thing would help you out to complete your unit number 13 this unit might sound very difficult but if you do it in a systematic manner you'll be able to easily complete the unit 
at least the important portions you if you feel uncomfortable in any of the topic i would recommend you that just skip it off do not waste your time in the same i did the same reason being it is not possible for everyone to understand all the 13 units in the holistic manner if you feel like that you are not able to attempt a question from a particular area just skip it off you still have other units you still have other areas you have to do only 25 questions out of the 75 question so work upon your strengths and do not focus upon your weaknesses that is very very important for you i hope these points would help you out in some way or the other in completing this unit if yes do let me know in the comment sections below and also thank you so much everyone for watching this video and do not forget to like share and subscribe to botany insider i'll see you very soon with the other answers of the other questions that have been asked by many of the students so thank you so much everyone for watching this video and i'll see you soon bye